gosh, I lost all of these, my favorite spinners, when we were in Colorado, of fish in the Rockies. But these blue fox spinners are probably one of my favorite ones. Now, as you can see, this is like this little strip of pond is literally, at least for small bodies of water, this little bit is the only one open. And even some of the bigger places, the bigger reservoirs around me are getting frozen up. I've seen people ice fishing already. So I was like, I'm not quite ready for ice fishing. So we're gonna try this a little bit. <laughs> See if we can get one out of the pond. And honestly, never fished here before. I've only, I've only tested lures here. I've only tested the bananas, but Welcome to another video. We got some uh, guests. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. We scared some right off the bank. Scared fish right off the bank. That's crazy. Oh, dude. It stinks. <laughs> it smells so bad. Dang, geese. Oh, dude, dude, there's brookies right there. Yo, there's a bunch of them. Dude, there's some good sized ones, oh my God. Dude, that's insane. Y'all, you can't even probably see all these brookies right in front of me. There's like a couple like very decent sized ones too. One did, one really came at it. Oh my God, that was embarrassing. Oh my God, start to see my breath. Dude, that bigger one is like just bullying the other ones. I'm gonna back up a little bit. I don't want them to see me too much. Oh, dude, they will just like, come on, commit to it. Really get after it. They're just kind of, I think they're instinctually just kind of hitting it. All right, this is where searching in your car and being a flippin' fishing freak comes in handy. So we'll cut that off. I've had a lot of success with those brook trout and a crappie magnet. So that's what we are gonna do. And then I even have a backup. I think that curly tail worm's just way too big and I think that hook's a little big or that I want. Dude, that's the thing with like, one thing I've noticed about like trout fishing, look at all them swirling up in front of me. Dude, that's the thing about trout fishing. I've noticed like, if, if I don't have the wind in my favor and it's real calm like this, I feel like my chances of catching them are kind of non-existent. gonna like really real slow really 
Just do nothing. Finesse her. Oh. See, they had some interest in it. They just, like, did not commit. Bastards. Oh my god, this one is beautiful. Oh my gosh. Yo, okay. Oh my gosh. Ooh, okay. We're gonna get a good release on you, my guy. There's cruising all up and down here. Oh, we got a, oh my gosh, this one's a chungus. Okay, this is the last one. He said like, legit, okay, I gotta, I gotta get you to that other side. That's way easier. To, dude, this one's a chungus. Look how big that one is. Oh my gosh, this is like. This is a proud angler one. Probably, I don't know. Oh my gosh. Look at you. Oh my gosh, you are beautiful. You're so cold. Oh. And there she is, and there she goes. Beautiful. All right, everybody, that is going to do it. Probably the last time we'll be able to fish this spot. I can't feel my hands. I'm cold. We'll see you for the next video.